We are going to solve question number third of exercise 7.3. Question says find the area of the triangle formed by joining the midpoints of the sides of the triangle whose vertices are 0, minus 1, 2, 1, and 0, 3. We have to find the ratio of this area to the area of the given triangle. Now, first of all, a triangle is given to us, the coordinates are given to us. <coughs> Uh, we have to find the area of the triangle formed by joining the midpoints of the sides of this triangle. Okay, now this is the first side and the midpoint of AB is D. This is the second side, midpoint of this is E. And this is the third side, midpoint of this is F. And if I join the midpoints, I have to find the area of this triangle. Now, to find the area of this triangle, first of all, I must know the coordinates of this, of these midpoints. And then using the formula to find out the area, I can find out the area. Okay, now, what is, uh, how we can find the coordinate of this midpoint? For that, we have a formula, whenever midpoint formula. Now, whenever we have to find the coordinate of the midpoint, in that case, the midpoint, to find out the x-coordinate, we have to add the x-coordinate of these two points. So that will be x1 plus x2. If I consider this point as x1 y1 and this as x2 y2, so the x-coordinate will be x1 plus one, uh, x2 upon 2. And similarly, to find out the y coordinate for this, it will be y1 plus y2 upon 2. So this is the midpoint formula here. Now let's find the coordinate for d using the same formula. <coughs> to find out the coordinate of d, d is the midpoint of ab. And to find the x coordinate, I have to add x1 with x2. So it will be 0 plus 2 and that has to divide it by 2. And in the for y coordinate I have to add y1 plus y2 upon 2. So that will be equals to this is 2. So 2 plus 0 is 2, 2 divided by 2 is 1, 1 minus 1 is 0, so 0 sum upon something is 0. Now let's find the coordinate for E and for E E is the midpoint of BC and using the same formula to find out the x coordinate for E I have to add x1 and y1 so it will be 2 plus 0 upon 2 and after that I have to add y1 plus y2 upon 2 to find out the y coordinate so 0 this will be 1 and this will be 4 divided by 2 is 2 now I have to find the coordinate of F now f is the midpoint of AC and again I have to add x1, y1 and then I have to divide it by 2 to find out my x coordinate for f. So here it is 0 plus 0. So 0 plus 0, sorry 0 plus 0 upon 2 and for y coordinate I have to add ok now this is 0 and 0 upon 2 is 0 and this is 2 and 2 divided by 2 is 1. So these are the coordinate of DEF. Now I have to find the area of triangle DEF. Now to find out the area we have a formula that the area is equal to how here the area is denoted by the small triangle. This is known as this is known as delta and to find out I have to multiply by x1 then by x2 and then by x3 this is how you can memorize this formula and after that I have to write y1 y2 and y3 and for x1 we have to hide x2 and then you have to write y2 minus y3 Then you have to multiply by x2, for that you have to hide x2 and then you have to write y3 minus y1. 
One thing is important, always you have to work clockwise. Okay. Now for x3, you have to hide this one and you have to write y1 minus y2. So this is the formula. Find out the area. Now let's find the area of triangle. Area of DEF. That will be equals to half. Now to find out the area of DEF, consider these two points as x1, y1 these as x2, y2 and these as x3, y3. Now, I have to multiply my x1 by y2 minus y3. So, y2 minus y3 will be 2 minus 1. <clears throat> okay. Now, plus, I have to multiply x2. My x2 is 1 and uh, multiplied by y3 y3 minus y1 then I have to multiply by x3 that is 0 by y1 or y1 is 0 minus y2 that is 2. For the solving this it is half 2 minus 1 is 1 1 multiplied by 1 is 1 it is 1, 1 multiplied by 1 is 1 and 0 multiplied by something is 0. So it will be 2 and 2 divided by 2 will be equals to 1 unit square. So this will be the area of DEF. Now I have to find the area of ABC which is the complete triangle okay now again I have to use the same formula for this triangle ABC consider this as x1 y1 this as x2 y2 and this as x3 y3 so I have to multiply it with x1 so here the x1 is 0 by y3 sorry y2 minus y3 so it will be 1 minus 3 then I have to multiply by x2 and here the x2 is 2 bracket y3 is 3 minus y1 and our y1 is minus 1 uh, I'm writing it over here uh, and then after that I have to multiply x3 our x3 is 0 multiplied by y1 y1 is minus 1 minus 3 so bracket closed now for the solving this it will be half here 0 multiplied by something will be 0 plus it will be 2 minus minus is plus so it will be 1 and again 0 multiplied by something will be 0 now for the solving this it will be half it will be 4 4 multiplied by 2 is 8 and 8 plus 0 plus 0 is 8 so solving this it will be 4 unit unit square ok So, this will be the area of this complete triangle ABC. Now, I have to find the ratio of this area to the area of the given triangle. So, the ratio of this, the ratio of area of DEF upon area of ABC will be equal to here. The area of this is 1 and the area of ABC is 4. So the ratio here should be 1 is to 4. So this is how you can solve this question. I hope you have understood this one. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel. And if you have any problem in maths, you can directly contact us. The phone number, the email address and the WhatsApp number is given below in the description. Thank you.